Everyone aim here for more Bonnie Vice like, after birth through the greeter mode, but Eden is this decent this is a good enough start. I'm totally fine just rerolling starts. Eh, some extra damage. Our stats are they're alright. The box of spiders is alright. Didn't get any start thing consumables in our shop kinda of sucks. Do I wanna roll it? Do I wanna roll this? Is it good enough? If eight yeah, we're fine. Yeah, it's fine. That's kinda of weak, like HP wise and I'm not starting to think Supals kind of sucks, but... I mean, our last run started off really strong and we threw it. Probably threw it? I think we could've... I think if we had more HP, we could've won. Which is frustrating, because that's, you know... Why didn't I have HP? I took a lot of damage. Why I took a lot of damage? It's bad. It's bad plays. Thanks, spiders. Appreciate it. So we need to just stop getting hit so much. <laughs> we need to work on that. Ox Spider's fine. Every two waves getting a couple spiders out. Oh, this is more damage. Ah, 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 ah. Ooh, okay. I wasn't scared, you're scared. What what are with the mole booms and the bombs? Please please calm down, game. You're scaring me. You're giving me a frighten. Right, let's pick up a key. Can't get something nice, I guess. No, there's no reason to open up that box. Because we can get a key out. I guess we can get a penny out of the lock. But, uh, oh, hey, I'm glad I didn't reroll this run. Got Magic Mush. Magic Mush, in case you don't know, is pretty good. I think we'll go for the the skinny odd mushroom as well. Get a little more tier. It'll affect our damage a bit, but we get the more tears. Get that, the fire rate up. Stop it. You're so fast. We're not particularly fast. Just more of these super fast gurglings. Greeter mode loves those gurglings at me. I love to take damage to them. He damage those and anything to sneeze at so far. But I do want the increased rate of fire, so I'll just pick up that. Yeah, there we go. Quad mo red monstro? It's quite a lot of monstro deal with game. Throwing a lot of monstros at me. A lot of cleft lips here. Cleft, cleft palettes, I guess is a more accurate. More accurate. Alright, one damage against quad red monstro. I'll, I'll live with it. I say it's almost good again. Drop his head. Don't drop. Yeah, we're probably gonna do that. Will aggressively drop down to one red art. And you know what? Instead of the spiders every two rooms, let's get guppies every wave. It's obviously a sure one to the curse room about before we're going to like, deal with the devil, because, yeah, whatever. I'll live. I mean, I won't necessarily live, we only have one red art, but. <laughs> I'll deal with the consequences of my decisions. Curse the blind? Uh, yeah. This got some HP back. Which means I probably won't be buying anything on this floor because we don't know what we're buying. There's not really any point on wasting, potentially wasting our money on. Uh, go to trash. We'll buy a key though. Just because that's good value. Not be, like, I wouldn't know what I'm buying anyway. Hide mine would be awfully nice now. Although, I guess it's not really because it has to help us against Ultra Creed. To be considering, because getting the Ultra Creed isn't the problem, defeating him is the problem. So we should be thinking how these items affect our Ultra Creed fight. And immunity to explosions is pretty much the number one thing we're looking for. Yeah, free pill. Feels like I'm walking on sunshine. So I can vulnerability pill of some kind? Never had that before, and broke the, the game was unhappy that I got it. Sinus infection, booger tears. I've not had this before. Some sort of cool tear effects. That's real unfortunate. It was an extra long enemy that spawned where I was walking. Is it like an explosivo or something? I don't. I don't know. Just stick him to him. 
And then what happens is explode. Does it do damage over time? It's like some sort of damage over time tier. It's like a stacking point. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Especially against uh, really tough enemies. Like greed. Like ultra greed. Problem being is it falls off when he jumps. It's not really that good because he jumps a lot. It looks like it is a effect that falls off. Ooh. But still, it's a pretty cool effect. I like that idea. I don't like, yeah, the enemy not popping up. But, but yeah, really expect Krampus in here. Perthrow is fantastic. Algis is also really good. I'll take Perthrow though. Do some new rolls. Items I don't want to see. The booger shot might have a similar concern for me as Explosivo, where sometimes you know I want the tier to be a tier to immediately impact the enemy, and then it's a little damage over time thing. Are we at the tier cap? Will that actually do us any good? Or do I need to reroll that? Army says we need to reroll that. <laughs> infinite bombs, infinite rerolls, we don't have a bomb, I'd walk over that, I'll take red R damage. We have a two cent compensation right here. Let's buy the key first and see what's in our item room. Alright. Nod leaf again. I get an orbital. Alright. Due to how powerful our rerolls suddenly become, because we get a cube of meat or something, we can just use that to cheese the game to victory. Oh, okay, well, you know, one regular bomb. Probably should hit that button first. Just save two cents. Bunch of batteries, don't a ton of flies. How's that gonna help? Black Candle is real nice here. The, oh, Plan C. <laughs> and our plans also the Plan C play. We get an extra life. More HP. Hmm, yeah, a little more uh, shot speed, I think. Is that what it looks like? Let's go for our deal with the devil. Because if nine lives is in there, we take back that we just win. That's our that's our ticket. Assuming it works, we're not 100 percent sure it works, but I'm, I'm relatively confident it should work. I would expect it to work. I don't know factually, but I would ex those are my expectations. That that would work just fine. Stop eating all my flies. We'll see what our deal with the devil is. Our deal with the devil is extra lives and then we are extra lives. And we are set. Also, we just need like. I mean, we don't need nine lives, you just one up would be perfect. Which is obviously shot by them, but we have not seen it. Now I can't reroll without rerolling plan C, and then there would be no point in picking up one up. Alright, we fight our bosses. Oh, I get away from it. Poker tiers on there for the. And I do like stacking damage over time, it's pretty cute. Oof. It seems awfully strong to send me so I don't jump around. Yeah. Stack of your shots on there. Feels pretty, pretty well. That's a very good, very good item. We should pick it up. Fortunately, there's no extra lives. And of course, should have gone to the cursor before we deal with the devil. Which does mean that hmm. <laughs> Plan C is not going to do it for us. Raw liver has a lot of HP. We need the HP. Don't need the battery, don't blank card without an actual card. There's no way to really abuse blank card. More HP would be okay, but we're looking for something to... Hey, yeah, we'll go with the more damage. Damage nails. 
still highly in the market for something to go with the Unbreakable. And I can leave the game running for half an hour while I go do something else. I go make lunch and come back and I'll play you in. But so far it's a pretty good Eden run. I'm playing, I definitely feel like I'm playing better. I'm taking so much stupid damage. All our HP still isn't good. That's not less of me playing poorly and just us not having a lot of opportunities to increase our HP. Um, oh, hey, that's our, um, that's our ticket. That's our orbital. Oh, hi. <laughs> What's up, Greed? Or the Keeper? I guess it was just Greed in disguise. He's on vacation taking a nap. And we woke him up. He was real mad about it. No booger shots. I'm also going to be farming this damage from... Where how'd that, how'd that get there? In that corner. I'm going to be farming these black tears. Not far off the void. And some jar of flies. I'd rather just have to go to that. That's your. It was just double check. We are. Yeah. Okay. It doesn't do anything. If we get rerolls, we can. Re I don't want to talk about that. If we get rerolls, we can reroll our shop items and stuff. It's not a big deal. Hey guys. Eleven damage is doing pretty solid. Especially, ah. Especially with all these flies. And this. Maw of the Void, which is not giving me any black hearts. Despite how useful this would be. Alright, alright, we're fine, we're fine. Things a okay. Be more okay if we could get black hearts out of our mod void. Much luck, we have terrible luck, that's probably why. Very poor luck. Um, yeah, we take that. So now we have an orbital. Damage was skin, and char flies. It might be better just to have the stacks of. <laughs> just have the jar flies stack up to 20 and then pop all of them. What are you guys popping bullets? Just can't stop. Oh, because you have the red flies. I understand. I'm not mad anymore. We're already in our cursor. Ooh, who's this? Oh, double skull X. My favorite enemy. Do the sinus infection shots do damage if they're not in this vulnerable spot? Kind of looks like no. I don't know why I. I bounce prematurely. I would, I would accuse you of bouncing prematurely there, Skull X. I can just kill one of you, I'd be really happy. We finally killed one. It's a really annoying boss. I just get impatient with him. That's the problem, I just get really impatient. Waiting for him to be properly vulnerable. If I die to you, I'm gonna be inconsolable. I did not die. Do I want Campion? Because that could be useful. We are, we are going hard on uh, losing HP here, though. But we also have... I guess it's really good, because we have... We take damage and spawn a familiar. That's really good for us, because we have Unbreakable, so it could be a familiar that does damage automatically, so that I can just... You know, stand here, go invincible, and then win that way. Which is an awfully boring way to do it, but... <laughs> you gotta do what you gotta do. What's our trinket? A good trinket? Shiny rock? Lucky rock? So blow up rocks, we get money? That could be extremely good. Depending on the number of rocks on the floor and our bomb situation, which isn't that good. And we have no bombs in here. Sad. We get a cheap key, though. I will walk in here. Power pill doesn't do me much good. Range upgrade, 40 hour energy, and I leave again. So at least I get out. Oh, a little like half hit. That's not our orbital. <laughs> With our unbreakable situation, that's exactly what we want. Get him flies. That's what you're here for. Ah, uh, don't walk on the creep, please. Great. 
I feel like I played much better this time over last time. Science, okay. I was supposed to do with that one. The science infection item seems really nice. You know, I got shot by a little, by a little, uh, little haunt. That's not that surprising. I don't have to be mad about it. It happens all the time. Dudes are jerks. Surprised it's a regular wave, not a boss wave. I also forgot to do that. Take the damage, that's Thunder Thighs. Might be worth it just to pop those rocks, although the speed downgrade would be kind of harsh. I think we'll still have some speed. We're not gonna have the best speed, but we'll still have some speed. Can I get some science infection stacks on there? There we go. Science detection seems really good. Maybe I'm just overvaluing, overestimating what it's actually doing for us, but it seems real good. I'll take HP before we go. We're gonna do the next fight. Yeah, this is a small speed downgrade. We're still plenty fast. We got a really good payout out of that. Oh, because we have Lucky Rock. That was obviously a good play. Kind of forgot. That's the way it going on. We get speed upgrade and closure of the spawn. Have we picked up other syringes? I don't remember. Let's see. Yeah, we have the uh, one syringe. Wait. Oh, I'll, I'll wait a moment on that. See what we get out of our deal with them. Ha! Ah, ah, ha! Where am I? Get the infection in there. Bleed him. I didn't bleed. Alright. That's our deal with the devil. Is Horror Pebble on my shadow? So I don't want those. Those are pretty bad. Yeah, those are pretty bad. I'm Horror Pebble on fine if we get to use it. I don't think it's going to be a factor in this run. Who D100 is our D100 thing? No, there's no way with D100. We have the win. We have the orbital plus the invincibility. So it's pretty much the win we have. I didn't miss a bunch of rocks to crush in that exit room, did I? I even, didn't even register in my mind. Alright, bombs are rerolls. Some more damage. You are not going to be a factor here at all. Let's go bunny up instead of going to the. It's a buying key. Give us money. What am I looking for? Definitely do not need that. I'm trying to trying to think, what do I really want here? A lot of money for rerolls. But we're not doing anything else out of money. Does it go down to 15 cents? I don't find anything to buy, it's more damage. Sound a little bit of damage earlier, of course. Fair what item was a real build, a damage item real build. I'm thinking, I'm starting to think that we are going to rely on our orbital invulnerability. Orbital plus invulnerability. This is a nightmare? I need to stop this. <laughs> that was getting out of hand. We to buy some HP. That's fine. But we couldn't afford to die in there. Also, should be doing a thing all the time, and I'm just, I'm just not. We can't really buy some HP. Please. It's <laughs> so annoying. Is he just never gonna pop up? Ever. Thank you. Of course, got shot by the ghosts, because the ghosts are awful and annoying. Oh. 
Dude, get off me. No, don't tell me we're too slow to get away from the masks. Kill it, kill it, kill it. Kill the other one. The science infection shot should be to stick to these guys. And for spot for us. I have four husks, or three husks. So, that's a little too many husks for my you know, personal appetite. Alright, just one mask left. Who is not taking damage getting stuck? Should be able to get in there with the orbital zone area. Or just the thing or the bond of void, which I'm chronically underutilizing. Ah, I don't want either of those. It did. It's how is he not dead? Still a good knockback. And then we're going to take our sweet time to model avoid these tentacles. And there's only one left getting anything out of it. Succubus is super good, it's not gonna do anything good though. It's not gonna, I mean, we just. Two of our HP? I mean, we're at, at this point, we're just gonna have to use our, use this combo in order to win. Having the succubus, he only attacks when we attack, so having it up is not gonna be very useful. So we actually, have, I'm just gonna say no. Let's see if we can buy anything more. Another orbital is really... At this point, I think we have to go for the boring win. Ah, no. Let's go Pandora's what Pandora's box gives us at this point. We take Binky. Get some uh, Spear Heart. <laughs> buy that Spear Heart. And we go give it a college try. I get some more money out of these rocks. Kind of forgot to check that first. Try getting our Spear Heart out of this. Yeah, we get our spirit out. It's not bad HP wise. Our damage is all right. We can probably fight the first stage normally, and then start fighting the second stage normally. And then once we realize we're boned and <laughs> are going to die, then we stand still, become invincible, and that's the end of the fight. Stacking these boogers on. Me. Yeah, stack these boogers on there. I'm feeling like these boogers are just going to be really good. In a really long fight like this. I was about to ask where we got all that money from. We just picked the quarter, obviously. Attack up the science faction. Make them super sick. All the boogers. Oh, you can just heal back up the fool because you got all the health plus all those all that money up there. He's just surrounded in boogers. Gross. There's a ring of boogers on him. I haven't been hit yet. That's a pretty good sign. He's not really summoning much stuff, though. Like, he's just kind of doing the real easy things. Where he stands around and stomps and throws things. We can't handle these guys as we did last time. Oh, we have a... We have a... Oh, the void. Of course, helps a lot. Dude, the booger's gonna kill him. Awesome. That booger shot's so good. Are they. Do, are they stick to them? Are they gonna. They're gonna stick? They're sticking. That's super good. Like I said, we get in trouble, we just. We just stop. We just stand still and let the boogers kill him. I didn't even realize. I don't know why. It's so obvious now. <laughs> the boogers will kill him. Unless he jumps. Once he jumps, they're just gonna reset, aren't they? But then the orbitals will take over. Dude, stop blowing these dudes up and getting money out of it and then healing or whatever. Yeah, there's all oh, our boogers. Sad. Don't go under them like you normally do when jumping enemies because he drops bombs. I had to learn that lesson the hard way like four times. Stop getting all the money. Whew. Okay, who is that? Stop it. Stop. Stop everything. Oh, thanks for the luck upgrade. Alright, 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 we're doing well, we're starting to lose control. I'm trying to manage the money a little bit. Did that punch really get me from that far? Look at these doors. 
These doors need to calm down. D what the heck? <laughs> With the door brimstones. I'm amazed. Alright, alright. Do I have to go into uh, defense mode here? Do I have to turtle up? I guess we can take two more hits before it's a uh, requirement. Oh, I got... Oh, awesome. I got Auto Baby from Gaming Conception. The one is time to hide. We have more damage to come. What? Come on! I can't hit him if he just jumps back and forth all the time. This is getting obnoxious. Dude, you have to. Alright, here we go. Uh, he's pretty low, so it shouldn't take that long for him to die, right? And we have Auto Baby here shooting at him. We're we marching around. I just absolutely can't move because I'll die. He will die eventually. That's so much money for him, though. He <laughs> can pick up. Auto Baby. Get him, Auto Baby. Pew, 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 pew. So the camping exception. I'm glad it worked out. That was, that was the plan. Hey, we did it. Which isn't surprising. We had the auto win combo. I was kind of hoping to do it normally. We almost did it normally. We almost did it without a, having to abuse Unbreakable. But I mean, that's what <laughs> that's what's there for. We got Unbreakable. We got Orbital. Included camping conception to make it go a little bit faster, and luckily it paid out. And we got the auto baby. So I'll shove in this money in here for no reason, and that's our Eden victory. And our Eden unlock. Almost didn't work. He's, he's a hard fight. I think we did a lot better at that time. That creator run that we have been the past few as far as uh, taking super damages. Kind of choked a little bit in the last fight, but I don't think I was fully invested because we had the fallback of the auto win combo. So I, guess I wasn't... I, maybe I'm just trying to cop out. Maybe it's a cop out. I wasn't trying that hard, but I don't know. It, we had the auto win combo, so it doesn't matter. We won. Next time, well, another challenge? I can go back to another challenge next time. Alright, thanks for watching. Do like, enjoy the video, subscribe for more fun, and Twitch tags. See you next time.